give God the praise and we give God the glory. We thank God for today and we bless the name of the Lord. Among the gods, He is God, and among the kings, He is King. We thank God for today. We bless the name of the Lord. We praise the name of the Lord for tonight. I welcome everybody uh, to the Grace to Do Exploit uh, special program today. We bless the name of the Lord. Um, <clears throat> we are going to get into prayer, please. Before the man of God will be uh, given the chance to uh, come through with uh, God's message for us tonight, um, if you can, if you are not busy and if you can put your video on as well so the man of god when he's communicating he'll be able to see the faces he's communicating to that is also a great thing god richly bless you we're going to get into prayer uh wherever you are uh the man of god is already online um uh, you will you will go on video when when we introduce him uh to connect with us um but we're going to get into prayer and uh, we're going to uh, thank God for today. We're going to bless the name of the Lord. We're going to praise the name of the Lord. We're going to honor the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. I want to join me. I want you to join me in prayer as we lift up prayer right now and give God the praise and all the honor for this opportunity to be gathered in His presence in the name of Jesus. So wherever you are, you can lift up your voice. Let's begin to pray in the name of Jesus. We we'll give you all the praise of God. Lebrando mosendele bele 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 bele, inda la 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 bosanda branda balabaya, inda la 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 bosanda branda balaba, kaya inda bosanda raba bali inda ya, inda la 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 bosanda labaya, leba bari inda bosanda laba laba be, inda ya balu inda bosanda raba baya, inda la balaba balu inda raba ya, he inda bosanda raba balaba ya, kapa la balaba baya inda la baya, he inda raba bal. Luanda la baya, ayanda la bala baba. Luanda masanda la babe, indele bele 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 bele. Ayanda la baya, ayanda la baba. Luanda ya kapala baba, ayanda masanda la baba. Ayanda, we give you praise and glory, O God. We magnify your name tonight. We lift up your name on high. Among the gods, you are God. Among the kings, you are king. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Glory be to your name, O God. From everlasting unto everlasting, you are God. The king of the universe, your name be lifted tonight, your name be praised tonight in the name of Jesus. Le kodolo boborianda, rapa palianda mazanda raba, le babaria kapala babaru anda mazanda, ianda boshanda randa la babaya, kapalianda bara babaya anda la babaya, ianda la babaru anda mazanda raba, kapalianda raba balianda la babe, le babaria anda bashanda raba, apalu anda Rabba Bayanda, the Andala Lala Baya Kapaya, the Paperi Andala Bayanda Laba, the Kunda Lebele Beperi and the Lebea, Ayanda Bajanda Rabba Baruandaya, the Paluanda Balaba Bariana Bazwanda Lava, the Telebele Bendelebo Shandele Benduma Kapa, the Paluanda Bajanda Rabba Baliandaya, the Paluanda Bajanda Lala Bayanda, the Mampalianda Rabba Balaba, the Banda. Lala la ba shanda branda be, raba balia kapali anda la ba ya, e anda la 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 ba shanda la brama ba ya, e anda la ba branda branda ba la 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 ba, kapali anda ba shanda raba ba, raba balia anda ya kapala ba la ba, e anda la 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 ba shanda branda la ba, e anda ba ya kapalu anda le 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 ya, e anda le 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 ya. Lift up your voice, give God some glory, magnify the name of the Lord with me right now. Lift up the name of the Lord, lift up the name. Name of the Lord, lift up the name of the Lord, lift up the name of the Lord. E mambala babaya, 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 mamb
Ayanda Mazanda Rabba Balianda, Papala Baraba Balianda Lava, Ayanda Baraba Balanda Mazanda Rabba, Papalanda Baraba Lava, Ayanda Lava Bayanda Lava, Rabba Balianda Lava Bayanda, Papala Baba Zanda Rabba Balianda, Ayanda Lava Lava, Papala Baraba, Rabba Balianda Mazanda Rabba, Lemenda Lava 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 Lava, Omanda Lava 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 Lava, Rabba Balianda Mazanda Rabba. We give you glory and we give you praise in the name of Jesus Christ. May your name be lifted, O God. May your name be lifted, O God. May your name be lifted, O God. May your name be praised, O God. Le malaba balianda bo, ayanda la la balianda la baya, raba balianda la baya, raba la balianda la baya, raba bala bala baya, raba bala bala yanda la ba, raba bala bala baya, ayanda. Rabba <laughs> In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. We are lifting up prayer once again. We are pleading the blood of Jesus in the atmosphere. We are praying in the name of Jesus. Let the blood wash us from every manner of sin tonight. Let the mandate of the blood cleanse us and set us on the place of righteousness, in the place of God's glory and God's favor tonight. Even in the name of Jesus, lift up prayer wherever you are. In the mighty name of Jesus, we plead the blood of Jesus. For the Bible declares, without the shedding of blood, there will be no remission of sin. We pray in the name of Jesus tonight, O oh God, by the reason of the blood, let it speak on our behalf this very hour. In the name of Jesus Christ, let the blood of the Lamb speak better things than the blood of Abel. In the name of Jesus, let Parosha Kabala Baba. Yanda Bashanda la Babaya, Apalanda Rabba Valianda la Babe, Lemba Palabanda Yaka Palababaya, Rabba Bazanda la Babayanda Yakapa, Ayanda Labo Shanda Bande Lebeleve, Ayanda Melebela Kapalanda la Babaya, Ayanda Mazanda la Babalanda la Babaya, Emma la Babaya Kapalaba la Baba, Ayanda la la Bazanda la Babaya, Emma la Babaya and la la Bosanda la Baya, Ayanda la 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 Baya. Kapayanda Bayanda, Rabba Bala Babaya, Kapala Babaya, Ayanda Mala Babaranda La Babaya, Lebam Belebe, Lebezenda Rebebe, Ayanda La 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 Baya, Kapala Bala Baba, Rabba Balianda La Bazanda Rababaya, Ayanda La Bala Babaranda Bazanda La Baya, Ayanda La 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 Baya, Kapala Bala Baba, Ebanda La 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 Bosanda La Baya, Rabba Balanda Ya Kapala Baba, Ayanda Zanda Rabba Balanda La Baba. In the mighty name of Jesus, let the banner of the Lord be raised, let your glory be seen in the name of Jesus Christ, and we will celebrate our God tonight in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Let the blood, let the blood speak better things tonight. In the name of Jesus Christ, let the blood cleanse the atmosphere. In the name of Jesus, from every manner of sin. In the name of Jesus Christ, we give you praise. Thank you, Lord. In the name of Jesus. Now we are lifting up prayer. Thank you, Lord. 
we are lifting up prayer once again that the spirit of God will take preeminence tonight that the power of God will move mightily in our midst tonight our yielding to the work of the spirit is that which caused the Holy Spirit to move in our midst and so we are praying that the spirit of God will take preeminence that the spirit of God will have his way in our midst tonight even in the name of Jesus Christ that he will heal the sick let the broken hearted be mended. Let the hopeless find hope. Let the feet of the wanderer be established in the name of Jesus Christ. Lift up prayer wherever you are. Spirit of the living God, except the Lord build the house. The builders shall build, but they shall build in vain. And except the Lord watch over the city, the watchers shall watch, but they shall watch in vain. Spirit divine, attend our prayer in the mighty name of Jesus. Move mightily in our midst tonight, O God. In the name of Jesus, we crave your indulgence tonight, Spirit of God. In the name of Jesus, without you, nothing can be done in, in this grounds, oh God. We connect tonight to your power and your will tonight. In the name of Jesus, let your mandate be made manifest, Spirit of God. In the name of Jesus, bind up the broken hearted, set the captives free. In the name of Jesus Christ, let the atmosphere be conducive for the move of the Holy Spirit tonight. In the mighty name of Jesus, wherever you are lift up your voice let us deliver let the atmosphere be conducive to us in the mighty name of Jesus Christ let Spirit of God, move in our midst. Let the power of the Lord be made manifest. Let the glory of the Lord be released. Let the anointing to do exploits be released. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus, let the la 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 the oil of the prophetic let the oil of healing be released in the mighty name of Jesus Christ let the oil of deliverance be released in the name of Jesus Christ 
Let the oil of joy be released. In Jesus Christ. Let Baba Baba Shanda Baba Baya. Baba 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 Yanda Baba Baya. Omar Baba Baba Yanda Baba Shanda Baba Baba. I am a Jani Mene Baka Pali Baba Baya. Rapa Baba Baba Yaka Baba Baya. Hey Yanda Baba Baba Shanda Baba Baya. Let Baba 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 Yaka Baba Baya. Rapa Pali Yanda Baba Baya. Move in our midst, Spirit of God. Let my Yanda Baba Baba Shaka Baba Baya. Rapa Baba Baba Yanda Baba. Let the atmosphere be conducive. Let the atmosphere be conducive. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Let Maduka Tale Madaba Yanda Baba. Rapa Pali Yanda Baba Yaka Baba. Rapa Palu Yanda Baba Zanda Baba. I am Tale Menebe Kapalu Yanda Le Mapea. In the name of Jesus Christ. The Son of the Living God. Let the move of the Spirit be tangible tonight. In the name of Jesus Christ. As we connect around the world. My Father, my Warrior. Let your mandate be made manifest. In the name of Jesus Christ. Let the grace to do exploits be released in the name of Jesus Christ. Ya kanda na bo shanda na baba ya. Rapa pa di anda ni makanda na baba. Ayanda mazanda na baba ya. Komanda na 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 shanda na baba ya. Ya kanda na bo shanda na baba ya. Rapa pa di anda na baba ya kapa na baba. Ayanda na 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 mazanda na baba ya. Le manda ni bede bede ya kapa ni bede bede anda ya. Rapa pa di anda na baba ya anda na baba. Ayanda mazanda na baba ya anda kapa ya. Rapa pa di Oh, Yanda Baba Baba, Yanda Baba Baba, Oh, Yanda Baba Baba, Le Mape Le Mede 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 Mede, Le Mape Le Mede Mede Mede, Papa Le Yanda Le Mede Mede Yanda Baba Baba, Papa Le Yanda Le Mede Mede Baba Yanda Baba Baba, Le Papa Le Yanda Baba Baba Yanda Baba Baba, Le Yanda Le Yanda Baba Baba, In the name of Jesus, Thank you, Lord. In the name of Jesus Christ. Now we are praying one more time. Any time there is an assignment, that there is an agenda of God. Satan also plots another agenda to counteract against the mandate of God. We are lifting up prayer tonight in the name of Jesus. And we are nullifying and destroying every agenda, every satanic agenda tonight. Any agenda of darkness to block the mandate of God from manifesting in the life of his people. Let that agenda be revoked in the name of Jesus. Any satanic verdict that has been taken and rendered against this meeting, we render it null and void in the name of Jesus. We are declaring by the power of the Holy Ghost and by the sweet ordinance of heaven and by the authority in the blood of Jesus. Let every satanic agenda against our meeting that will block deliverance, that will block healing, that will block the mandate of God from manifesting. Let that agenda be subjected and be arrested in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Lift up prayer wherever you are in the name of Jesus. Wherever you are tuning in, whether you are on Facebook, whether you are on Zoom, whether you are on YouTube, whether you are on live stream, whether you are on Empowerment TV, I want you to connect to this prayer tonight. Let the atmosphere be open. Let the atmosphere be conducive. Let every agenda of darkness to block the mandate of God tonight be arrested in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Let it be let it be deemed null and void in the name of Jesus. Every satanic verdict, let it be overruled in the name of Jesus Christ by the virtue of the blood, by the victorious power of the blood. Let every Every agenda of darkness be overruled in the name of Jesus Christ. Ayanda bakapala bara babaya, raba bayanda bara boshanda babaya, leka dala babaya. I feel the power of the Lord. Lift up prayer. Leka dala bashanda babaya, raba boria kada bashanda babaya. Ayanda babo kapali anda babaya, ayanda bara raba shanda babaru anda babaya, leka dili babaru anda babaya anda bashanda babaya, raba baria kada babaya anda babaya, ayanda. Let me never be under the belly of the man. Let me never be under the belly of the man. Let me never be under the belly of the man. Let me never be under the belly of the man. Let me never be under the belly of the man. Let me never be under the belly of the man. Let me never be under the belly of the man. Let me never be under the belly of the man. Let me never be under the belly of the man. Let me never be under the belly of the man. Let me never be under the belly of the man. Let me never be under the belly of the man. Let me never be under the belly of the man. Let me never be under the belly of the man. Let me never be under the belly of the man. Let me never be under the belly of the man. Let me never be under the belly of the man. Let me never be under
We nullify every power of hell, every satanic agenda, every demonic castrations against the meeting tonight. We render it powerless in the name of Jesus Christ. I arrest every satanic agent that has been sent with an assignment. I terminate that appointment in the name of Jesus Christ. in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord. Amen in this house. Victorious amen in this house. Victorious amen in this house. We are lifting up another prayer. You are praying. Let the oil of Ganassaret be released. Let the oil that allows men to do exploit in the land of the living, even in the midst of the pandemic, let that oil be released. The Bible says that there was famine on the land. But Isaac sold on that same land, on that same land, Amen. not on a different land, on Amen. that same land, and he reaped abundance. Yes. We are praying in the name of Jesus. Let the oil that override pandemics, let the oil that override any level of mountains, and let the oil that override opposition, let that oil be released tonight. That oil that causes men to do exploit, that oil that caused Daniel to do exploit, even in the midst of captivity. Let that oil be released tonight, even in the name of Jesus Christ. Let it be released in your household. Let it be released in your life. Let it be released in every aspect of your life, your children's life. Let that prayer, wherever you are. Hey, Makadaba, Rabapala Baba Yadaba, Ayanda Ladaba, Sanda Ladaba, Kapalianda Laba Baruanda Labaya, Lema Palaba Baba Barianda Labaya, Kapalaba Baba Baruanda Labaya, Lema Barianda Ladaya, Kapalanda Laba Bayanda Baya, Lema. Let that oil be released. Rabba 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 Rabba
Thank you, Lord. We give God the praise. Thank you, Lord. In the name of Jesus. I sense a, a, a strong anointing in the atmosphere tonight. Amen. I sense a great anointing in the atmosphere tonight. Amen. I tell you, um, I believe that this is an appointment of God. I believe that this is an appointment of God. And wherever that you are tuning in, I believe that you are hungry for that which God is about to deliver unto us this very hour. Listen, if I am going to accelerate on any grounds, it is my readiness to seize the opportunity that is given to me by God. This is an opportunity. This is an opportunity and cannot be taken lightly. And so if you respond in the same old ways of you responding to things, then tonight you want to take that attitude. You want to have an attitude of a hungry man, an attitude to receive, an attitude of of receptiveness, an attitude of of I don't careism, like I'm not caring about anything. I'm ready for what God is about to deliver into my life. Glory be to God. Uh, 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 Even though today is my birthday, I believe that it's an appointment of God. It's an appointment of God. I believe that God uh, brought me into the world for a time such as this, that that through through my life, somebody will be impacted by God's power and God's glory and God's faithfulness in their lives. And so I don't want you to take this very lightly. I don't want you to take it lightly. I want you to take it on a high level, an appointment you've got with God. Am I talking to somebody? Prophetically, I see that horns are about to be blown. Prophetically, I see that horns are about to be blown. That means that horns of victory, triumph, there's going to be a heavy triumph over over certain things in life. You're going to triumph over certain areas of your life tonight. And I believe that if you came with the heart ready to receive and ready to to contend, I believe that somebody is going to receive tonight. Glory be to God. I have a friend of mine, a prophet friend of mine, is a great friend. We started ministry practically together. Practically together, I mean, I mean practically together. We're, we're in the same school together, and I believe the time that God called, uh, called God called me. He was also, uh, uh, he was also into the calling, and God was using him mightily uh, throughout the years. We have been, uh, we have been in, in touch, uh, and uh, I know that the anointing of the Lord is upon him. We we've, we've known ourselves for. Uh, for for most of our lives in ministry, okay, we grew up together. If you are looking for people who know my beginnings, he is one of them that you can consult. The people who know your beginning and they 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 are connected with you now means that there are people that believe in your ministry. They know where you are coming from, and they they believe in where God is taking you. And tonight, I'm really really privileged to have this great man of God. With, with with us tonight. Amen and amen. I, I remember when we were back in school, um, um, when we started the ministry and we were praying together. Uh, we did a lot of prayings together. We did a lot of ministry things together. And little did we know that it was going to produce preachers. And I tell you, preachers have been produced. 
Mm. A lot of preachers have been produced. And, and we thank God for that, for, for that pro, for productivity. And we don't mention names because it is not to our glory, but to the glory of the Lord. But it tells you how far we've come from. And I believe in his ministry. I believe in the hand of the Lord that is upon his life. Uh, I, I've tasted it. I have seen it. Mm. I've experienced it. And I cannot doubt it without a shadow of a doubt. I know who uh, I'm talking about. He's a wonderful friend and he's a very, very humble man down to earth, but he's full of God's wisdom and the word of God. And I thank God for tonight, uh, for the life of Prophet Charles Mensah, my very good friend. We sat in the same class together. I mean, we have a whole lot of funny stories to tell. But <laughs> I thank God for your life tonight. Man of God, God richly bless you for, for joining us uh, tonight. Uh, you, you, are, you are welcome. And uh, we give you the platform uh, to take over. We give you the platform to take over. God bless you. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Um, um, I'm, I'm delighted to be here tonight um, to join you. And I believe that um, God is up to something in our lives. Um, I, I also thank you for giving me this opportunity um, to be with you. And I believe that... Um, our lives will never be the same. Um, first of all, I want to thank you and also bless God for your life. Today, celebrating your birthday, it's an achievement. You know, it is not everyone that's starting has been able, to, uh, been able to come to this extent, except the grace of God. Had it not been the Lord on our side, where would we have been by now? That is what David said. He said, then he said that from the snare of the fowler and the snare of the fowler. Hallelujah. Praise Amen. the Lord. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. And, and, and we thank God for what he's doing with your life. I really appreciate you so much. And uh, I've, been, I've been following you online and, and, and I'm always blessed by your ministry. You know, deep down there, when we started ministry, when we were in school, it, it was... It was through your fire, that, that gave us also that, that grace to also stand on our feet. Then we, we, we had the calling, but we are not able to come out boldly to say this. But God, through you, brought that life in us. We thank God for your life, and we thank God for where it's taking you to. Amen. I know what it's about to do in your life. And I know God will continue to bless you. Amen. Amen. Amen, Amen man of God. Amen. Tonight, I want to um, quickly um, take you to the word of God so we can pray. I believe that God is up to something. I want mm -hmm. to minister to something I've entitled, The Evidence is True, but the Story is False. The mm -hmm. Evidence is True, but the Story is False. Mm -hmm. I, I know you are, blessed. you are going to be blessed this morning, this evening, sorry. The Evidence is True, but the Story is False. Are you there with me, please? Yes. The Evidence is True. But the story is false. Now, let me quickly make some profound statements so we start our message tonight. The mm. size of your battles determines the, the size of your victory. Mm. The size of your battles determines the size of your victories. Number two, you must understand that your assignment decides and determines your adversaries. Mm. Your assignment decides and determines your adversaries. Now, probably because of what you are going through, you might think that the God, God that you serve has neglected you. But it is because of your assignment. It is because of your assignment. Number three, your adversaries determines your promotion. Your adversaries determines your promotion. I believe you are following me too, this evening. That's right. Determine your promotion. When God calls you, God takes you through a process. And after the process, there will be a product. Now, in other words, you cannot abort the process and have the product. If you want to have the product, then you must go through the process. Now, when you read Genesis chapter 1, verse 26, the Bible said, 
And God said, let us make man in our own image and likeness. And let him have dominion over the things of this earth. Now, the word image means negative. In other words, God wanted to create a negative of himself. That when men see you, they see God in you. Mm. Because you are the one going through the process for the product to come out. That when God sees, when men sees your process, they can be able to attain that product in you. Amen. Amen. Now, you must understand that when 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 Joseph was in when Joseph had a dream, I'm, I'm building you up to my message tonight. Just follow me. That is how I am. I'll come there. When Joseph had a dream, the Bible said he did not know what to do. Then Joseph was not mature. He had not been through the process. And because of that, he was not matured to handle the blessings. God blesses people who are mature. Your blessings depends on your maturity. So what you go through matures you to receive what God gives unto you. Mm. Are you there with me, please? Right. Joseph was not able to interpret the dreams, so he showed his destiny out to his brothers. And the brothers mm. sold him into captivity. Now, for the brothers, they were selling him into captivity. But for to God, he was sending him forth. My God. The brothers were selling him, but for God, he was sending him forth. Now, that was the process he went through. Now, the Bible said, when now he was in prison, after he had gone through the process, now Joseph was mature to be able to handle dreams and affairs in life. So the Bible mm. said, when the people had, had dreams, they, they, they dreamed about something. Joseph was able to interpret that dreams unto them. Because now Joseph has gone through the process and now he is mature. So God blesses people who have been through it, gone through it, and blesses them to where they belong to. I believe that tonight the Lord will take you to where you belong. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 We are talking about grace tonight. Grace is to be in the permanent state of favor. Grace is to be in the permanent state of favor. Grace is to be in the permanent state of favor. Favor is the ability of God to cause your star to shine. Favor is the ability of God to cause your star to shine. Grace is the container of favor. So mm. when... When you are favored, when you are grace, God is able to single you out among the rest. My so God. You don't deserve something that you, you, you don't have to see it in your life. But God look among the friends and single you out and gives you that ability. Mm. God would do it this afternoon. So grace mm. is the ability of God. Sorry, this is grace is the ability of God stepping into the inability of a man. When right. men saying that there is a cast down, grace is saying that there is a lifting up. Mm -hmm. So that's what grace does to our lives. So you must understand that when grace is available, no matter what the enemy does, the Lord will pick you up from nowhere and put you on a lamb light. In the name of Jesus, I declare upon you. That which has been said against you, the Lord will use that same thing to open up a greater door for your life. In mm. Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Genesis chapter 39. Genesis chapter 39. Let me bring my message and then we begin to pray. I am I am I am in, in the mood to, to pray this evening. Amen. Amen. My God. Are you there, please? Genesis chapter 31. Because of that, you want to read 30, verse 1. Verse 7, verse 13, and verse 20. Verse 1, verse 7, verse 13, and verse 20. So let's read. Genesis chapter 39, verse 1. And Joseph was brought down to Egypt, and Potiphar, an officer of Pharaoh, captain of the guard, and Egyptians, bought him of the hands of the Ishmaelite, which had brought him down to Verse 7. And it came to pass. 
after these things that his master's wife cast her eyes upon Joseph and he said, lie with me. Verse 13. Because of time, we want to jump. Verse 13. And it came to pass when she saw that he had left his garment in the hand and was fled from him. Verse, verse 20. And Joseph's master took him and put him into the prison, a place where the king's prisoners were bound and he was there in the prison. Now, can we um, stress on the verse 13? Verse 13. And it came to pass when she saw that he had left his garment in her hand and was fled forth, that she called, verse 14, that she called unto the men of her house and spake unto them, saying, See, he had brought in an Hebrew unto us to mock us. He came in unto me to lie with me, and I cried with a loud voice. And it came to pass when he heard that I have lifted my voice and cried, that he left his garment with me and fled him out. The evidence is true, but the story is false. Mm. The evidence is true, but the story is false. Child of God, you must understand that it was God that created everything. Number one, number two, everything that God created was with the future. Uh -huh. Everything that God created was with the future. The future is the predetermined purpose of a thing. The mm -hmm. predetermined purpose of a thing is the future. And the goal of all creation is to make it your destiny. The goal of all creation is to make it your destiny. If you do not make it your destiny, you have disappointed God. Because mm. your focus of your destiny will give God, God pleasure. When you are able to fulfill your destiny, it makes God happy. The end of the future is, is something that you must take notice of and make sure you work towards it. Because that is what makes God happy. Your destiny is your purpose trapped in your beginning. Whatever you achieve does not surprise God, but it brings him because he already knows it. You know, God created us to be winners and in our generation. So God has hidden in you what you are destined to become. Mm. Mm. Are you me, yeah. Yes. What God is about doing, he has done it for you. It is in you. Somebody say it is in me. It is in me. God has completed what you are about starting in your life. And he has given you a purpose so he will help you to fulfill it. Amen. What is an evidence? An evidence is one or more reason for believing something is true or not. That is an evidence. The dictionary or the 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 uh, um, Oxford dictionary will say it is anything that you see, experience, read, or actual that causes you to believe that something is true or not. That is evidence. So, but the king's wife had an evidence. The evidence was Joseph's clothing. The Bible says. When she took hold of that boat, Joseph escaped and ran away. And as Joseph escaped, she came out and started shouting to the people that the guy that you brought to this house has come to mock him. This is the was the attack that was in the hand. But the story that she told about Joseph was false. Child of God, I have come as a man of God to declare upon you every evidence leveled against you in the courtroom of God shall be wiped off by the blood of Jesus. Wow. 
evidence about Joseph, and the evidence was the cloth that the woman had in her hand. She said a lot of things about him that wasn't true. People are saying things about your life. Evidence because of what they saw, they have evidence because of what they have at your workplace, in your family, where you find yourself. People have a lot of evidence against you. Some of the evidence that you don't know where those things are coming from. But the Lord said, I should tell you tonight that every evidence that is leveled against you shall be taken off from your life. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Life in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. You will not switch it. The evidence is true, but the story is false. The evidence is true, but the story is false. The evidence is true, but the story is false. They have an evidence against you. They said you cannot make it in life. They said because of where you are coming from, from your background, they will not allow you to succeed because you have a stigma. Those things. Listen to me, child of God. You are not what people say you are, but what God says you are. Amen. You know what they can against you. God has the upper hand, and God will see you through, and God will deliver you from what they are saying. Jesus. Now, please just follow me. I'm, I'm, I'm building. Let's go to Second Samuel chapter sixteen. Second Samuel chapter sixteen. Uh, I'm so happy to be in your midst tonight. I'm so happy. Second Samuel chapter 16. Second Samuel chapter 16. Verse, verse number one to four. Number one to four. Are you there, please? Yeah. Okay. And when David was a little person on top of the hill, so Ziba, the servant of Mephibosheth, met him with a couple of axes, saddled and upon, upon them 200 loaves of bread and 100 bunches of raisins and 100 of summer fruit and a bottle of wine. And the king said unto Ziba, What meanest thou this? And Ziba said, The axes be for the kings to ride on the bread, to ride on, and the bread, the summer fruit for the young men to eat, and the wine that such as be faint in the wilderness may drink. My God. And verse 3 said, And the king said, And where is thy master's son? And Ziba said unto the king, Behold, he abided at Jerusalem. Please, on the line, this is your, is your He abided at Jerusalem, for he said today, Shall the house of Israel restore me the kingdom of my father? Then said the king to Ziba, Behold, that are all that pertain unto Mephibosheth. Mm. So, I humbly beseech thee, I may find grace in the sight of my Lord. Okay. Let's go to 2 Samuel 19. 2 Samuel 19, verse 24. 2 Samuel 19, verse 24. I think this is my last part, uh, one scripture. Then, then we are done. Second Samuel chapter 19, verse 24. Are you there, please? Yes. People said, the son of Saul came down to meet the king and had neither dressed his feet, nor trimmed his beard, nor washed his feet from the day the king departed until the day he came again. And it came to pass. When he was come to Jerusalem to meet the king, and the king said unto him, What for one thing not thou with me, Mephibosheth? And he answered, My lord, O king, my servant deceived me, for thy servant's name I will saddle me and ask that I may ride on that on to the king, because thy servant is slain. And he had slandered thy servant unto my lord, the king. But my lord, the king, is as an king of God. Do therefore what is good in thy eyes. If the Bible is yours, underline the angel of God. Do therefore what is good in thy eyes. For all my father's house were but dead men before my lord, the king. Yet did there's no servant among them that did eat at thy own table. 
yet to write. Therefore, have I yet to cry anymore unto the king. Amen. Now, Amen. I mean, we all know um, Ziba and Mephibosheth. When David came onto the throne, David asked that, is there anyone left in the house of Saul that I must show mercy on? I'm still speaking on the evidence is true, but the story is false. Is there anyone left in the house of Saul that I must show mercy on? And the Bible said, and Ziba came. Now, as soon as Ziba came, Ziba introduced Mephibosheth to Ziba. Hey, Mephibosheth to David. Then he said, there is still one more person that is left. And his name is Mephibosheth. But he slain. My God. Mm. David only asked someone left. David did not ask whether someone was slain or not. Mm. All that he asked was, is there anyone left in the house of Saul that I might show mercy on? But when Mephibosheth Mef came, Ziba said, there is a guy called Mephibosheth, but he was slain. Child of God, sometimes people always call us according to the things we go through and they give us name according to the things we go through. They look at what you go through and they begin to identify you according to that thing. But the Lord said, I should tell you tonight, every level thing against your life, tonight he will take it off from you. In the, In the name of Jesus. The Bible said, he said, then Ziba introduced Mephibosheth to David. Now, when Absalom chased the father from the palace and David was running away, Ziba took bread, took blood, and took other things to go and meet the king on the way. Now, what was he trying to do? Ziba was trying to, to, to deceive the king for the king to know that Mephibosheth is not the right person to sit at the king's table. It mm. was Ziba who introduced Mephibosheth. But the same Ziba went at, ahead of uh, Mephibosheth and said bad things about Mephibosheth to the king. Mm. So when the king was about leaving, the king gave every property that he has given to Mephibosheth back to Ziba. Now look at this. When the king was coming back to the palace, and the Bible said that Mephibosheth went to meet the king. He had not trimmed his hair. He had not bathed. He had not changed his apparel. Everything about him was not in a good state. And when the king saw Mephibosheth, he said, Mephibosheth, where have you been? Why is it that when I was going in, you couldn't go with me? He said, my king, look at me. Do I look like someone who was enjoying when he left? I have mm. gone before God and pray to God for you to come back. And the king said, I am sorry. I didn't know, but I have given everything to, to Ziba, but I want to divide. Mephibosheth said, no, king. Don't divide anything. Let him take it. Child of God. He said, let him take it. Now, this is the secret. He said, as long as you are an angel of God, come to me. As long as you came back from this war, as long as you are alive, I will sit at the king's table and eat with the king. I don't mm. care about things. I don't care about material things. But as long as my God is alive, seek him first the kingdom of God and eat righteousness and all other things shall be followed. Mm. I have encourage you that which you are going through will not end your life. It is a mere evidence, but God will use that same thing to bring you to the land of life. They can't stop you. They cannot stop you. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I said, mm -hmm. stop you. No matter what they do, God will be with you. Amen. Amen. As long as you came alive, that is the secret. Mephibosheth was not looking for material things. Mephibosheth understood the, the law of connection. Hear me out. What you connect to determines where you collect from. Mm. Mm. Your connection brings your collection. Mm. Are you here? Amen. Connection brings your collection. Mephibosheth was he was interested in the connection he had with David right. because one 
who was not qualified to sit at the king's table could now sit at the king's table and eat with him. He said, my king, give him the properties because I know that as long as you can do with you are alive, those properties will come back to me. Hmm. The evidence that Ziba had against him was that he said, Mephibosheth has spoken evil against the king. But when the king came back and Mephibosheth saw the need to connect to God, the Bible said, David reminded him, David re 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 remembered him and brought him to the king's table. Then Mephibosheth acted with the king from that day again. And hear me out. Those that brought those evidence, Ziba, his name is not mentioned again in the Bible. The day that saw the need to connect with the king, Mephibosheth connected and started collecting from the king. Ziba was not mentioned again. I have come tonight to let you know, those that brought that evidence against you, that king's wife that is holding that evidence against your life, Never give up. Barada Shakada. My God. But you are not what they are saying you are. You are what God says you are. Amen. Last chapter eight. I end with the beginning of pray. God is speaking to me about some people in the house, and I want to quickly just finish it up. Then we begin to pray. Hallelujah. Romans yes. chapter eight, verse twenty-eight. Romans eight twenty-eight. My God. Grace to do exploit. After this, you people are going to do exploit. I know it. In the name of Jesus. Romans 8, 28 to, I think, number 31. And also, I know we know we know this scripture. For we know that we are together for good to them that love God, to them who are called according to his purpose. Yes. For who he did for new, for no, sorry, he also did predestinate to be conformed to the image of his son, that he might be the firstborn among many brethren. Moreover, whom he did predestinate, mm. he also, and whom he called them, he also justified. And whom he justified, then he also glorified. Praise God. Praise Hallelujah. God. Now, um, just, just hear me out, then we begin to pray. The Bible said, for all things work together for good, for those that love God and call according to his purpose. Now, we, we have something we call the courtroom of heaven. And in the courtroom of heaven, what we have is that we have God being the judge. Are you following me, please? Yes. We have God being the judge. God is the judge in the courtroom. Then we have Jesus, the lawyer. Jesus is the lawyer. Jesus is your lawyer. Then we have the, the other lawyer who is the enemy, the accuser of the brethren. The accuser of the brethren. So what it means is that the devil or the accuser of the brethren comes to the courtroom. Now, in the court, he presents his case. He, he brings his evidence to God, to, to God and to the people in the court. Now, I want to be practical tonight. Hear me out. When he brings his evidence to the people, then he will begin to read it out. They will mention your name. Maybe you, your name is Anita. Maybe your name is Kojo. Maybe your name is Mavis. Maybe your name is Atta, whoever. They mentioned the name and he said, uh, Kojo did that, Kojo did this, 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 and that. Therefore, he must be sentenced. Now, when it happens so, God now comes to his son, Jesus Christ. Then he asks his son, what do you want me to do now? Because you are the judge for, 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 for the accuser. Then, the, the, then Jesus comes to God and said, my friend, it is true that your son has committed this case. It is true that evidence is true. But for my blood's sake, because of my blood, I have wiped every evidence. 
And therefore, I may, hey, I have made God, him God, pure. God. Therefore, I have made him pure. Amen. Therefore, he is pure. Everything leveled against him has been wiped off by the blood. Amen. Now then, God comes to him and speaks him. Then he tells the accuser, because my son came to share his blood for my children, you cannot touch him any longer. He said, for those that he called, to them he justified. And for those that he justified, to them he glorified. So after justification, God glorifies your life. I am mm. trying to tell you today, every level thing against you, every day, whatsoever, be it family background, being it from your, your workplace, from your community, from wherever you are, the blood of Jesus has taken over. That why mm. I when I see when I see the blood, everything leveled against you has been wiped off. He said, from henceforth, let no man touch and destroy me, for I bear the mark of the Lord in my body. Joseph was in prison. Joseph was put in prison because of that evidence. But when the time came for God to glorify, the Bible said, and grace spoke, and grace spoke, and grace mm. spoke. Mm. Grace mm. in a state of favor. When God began to speak, uh, nobody could put Joseph down. Someone who has been in prison, someone who has been in the pit, someone who has been de rejected, neglected, dejected in life, was now accepted as a prime minister in a foreign land. When grace speaks on your life, it doesn't matter where you are. It doesn't matter the evidence. You shall be accepted by God. In the name accepted of Jesus. Jesus. Let that grace speak upon your life. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Of God, stepping into the immobility of man. The ability of God. When you look at Mephibosheth, Mephibosheth was not qualified. Apart from that, he was not qualified to sit at the king's table. Ziba spoke evil about him. Mm -hmm. But it was grace. That located him again. Mm -hmm. Now, you don't need man, for man will disappoint you. But when men reject you, God promotes you. Amen. The is the promotion of God. When mm -hmm. grace speaks, it doesn't matter where man has pleased you, God will lift you again. Mm -hmm. When grace speaks, it doesn't matter what people have said, like Joseph, about your life, God will lift you up again. I don't know what you are going to do, but I see God lifting you up one more time. You shall be lifted. Every distraction will become construction in your life. Amen. Every, Amen. Will to Every disgrace will turn into grace. The Lord will fulfill you. The Lord will single you out and he will grace you like this. Amen. I happen to, I happen to travel somewhere recently and uh when i was when i was traveling and uh, one of the air hostess you know them you know that uh i i i i needed help because my then my money that was on me was missing so i needed help that i couldn't go to anyone i was just there just looking at everyone I was praying in my head. I said, God, favor me. Let someone favor me. Mm. So as I was there, as if I went to her, I saw this lady walking towards me. When she got me, she said, said, Sir, can I offer you a help? Mm. I was like, ah, Who told you I needed help? Mm. Because I, then I've not told anyone that my money was missing. And she mm. said, I could see from your face. That you need help. Then I just told her what I was going through. Immediately I opened my mouth. She said, I know you were a good man, therefore I will offer you that help. Hallelujah. Oh, now, I... grace. You need that grace. Oh, I don't know about it. It would offer you help at any time. When you lack grace, you will struggle. When there is no grace, People struggle. 
Yes. If there is no grace. People come down. I have seen men who maneuver their way through to the top and now they are down because they lack grace. Look, you can do it with your strength, but for bad things shall no man prevail. Mm. You can do it, but when grace is not available, you will come down again. Mm. And that is why you need to connect your life to Jesus because he is the only, only one who can know our beginning and know our end, who can only help you when you are down. You know, sometimes we tell ourselves that we have friends, they can help us, they can bless us. But I tell you, you have not been there. When Joseph was in prison, nobody called him. Right. When Joseph was in prison, all his friends left him. Mm-hmm. It was God. Oh, that orchestrated his way through and brought him out from prison. You are coming out from the prison yard to the palace. Amen. Because Amen. your hands shall begin to tangle wherever that you are. Come on, begin to tango. <laughs> In the la 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 ba zanda ra ba ba la ba ya. In the la 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 ba zanda ra ba ba ya in the la ba ra ba ba ya in the la ba ya ka ba la ba ba. In the ba ya in the ba zanda la ba ba la ba ba ya. O ma la ba la ba ba ya in the ra ba ba ya in the la. Ma de le be le be be ya in the la 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 be. E ba ba ya ka ba la ba ra ba ba ya in the la ba. E ma ra ba ba ya in the la ba ya in the la la ba. Rabba, <laughs> Rabaya, <laughs> <laughs> 
For those the people that know their God shall be strong and they shall do as good. As we have connected to God, we are praying that we our connection bring our collection. Let our connection with you our collection. The thing that is God for us, we possess our possession. We take over what belongs to us. We take over now in the name of Jesus. Open up. A baleman de la boshanda banda balaba, Rabba balia cadole mede bayantaya balaba, Rabba baluanda bajanda la babaya, A baluanda rabba bajanda la balaba, Eantele beberia capaluanda bajanda la ba, Rabba balianda bajanda la baba, Emala babalianda la 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 bajanda. Anda la 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 ba ya anda la ba ba ya anda la la ba ya anda la ba ba ru anda la ba aba le anda ra ba ba la ba ba ya anda la ba aba la ba ba ya anda la ba ba ya anda le ba le ba le ba ba ri anda la la le ba ya ba la ba ba ru anda ra ba ba ya anda la ba e anda la ba ya anda ra ba ba le anda la ba anda ya ba le anda la ba la ba ba ya ra ba ba le anda la 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 ba ya anda inda la 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 ba ya anda ra ba ba la ba Le baba la baba ya anda la baba ya anda la baba ya ke mandele bele 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 ya anda la baba baba la baba la baba lo anda la baba ya ya anda la baba ya anda la baba ya ya anda la baba ya divine collection in the name of Jesus ya ya anda la baba ya anda la baba ya ya anda la baba ya lo anda la baba ya anda la baba ya baba le baba ya anda la baba ya anda la baba ya anda enda la 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 baba ya ka ba ya anda la baba enda la baba ya anda la baba la baba Ayanda bajanda rababa, emala baba lianda la 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 baya. Ayanda bajanda rababa lianda ya, inda la 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 baba baba yanda. Rababa la baba janda la baya, lemanda la baba baba lianda lemale bas. Ya kada la baba yanda la baba, rababa la baba ya kapa la baba baba, rababa la baba baba yanda la baba, ayanda la 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 baya yanda la baba, rababa lianda la baba baya, ayanda la 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 baya kapa la baba baba. Rabba <laughs> Oh, my God, my God, my God. 
yanda la 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 ba yanda ya ba ra ba ba yanda ya ta ba la ba ra ba ba le ba da la ba la ba ba yanda la 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 be ya ka de le 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 yanda la ba ba yanda la ba ya la ba da ba ba la ba ba ra ba ba yanda la ba ba yanda la ba ya ha yanda la ba ya ka ba la ba ba ya ra ba ba la ba yanda la 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 ba ya ha yanda la ba la ba ba ya ka da la ba ba ya ha manda la ba ba ya yanda la ba ba ya ha ka da la ba la ba ba ya yanda la ba ba ya ra ba ba la ba ba ya ka ba la ba la ba ba ra ba ba la ba ba ya yanda la ba ba ya ha yanda la 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 ba ya ka ba la ba la ba ra ba ba ya yanda la ba la ba ba ya yanda la ba ha yanda ba ya yanda ya ka ba la ba ba ya ka ba ko ra ba ba ya yanda la ba la ba ba ya ha yanda le 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 ya ko ya yanda ra ba ba la ba ba ya ya ka da la ba la ba ba ya yanda ba bo sha ta la 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 ba e ma da la 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 ba ya ka ba la ba la ba ba ra ba ba ya yanda la ba la ba ya divine connection into divine collection in the mighty name of jesus ra ba ba la ba ba ya ka ba la ba ya le ma da la 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 ma sha da la ba ba ya yanda la ba ra ba ba ya ka ba la ba la ba ba ra ba ba la ba la ba la ba ya e ma da la 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 ba sha da la ba ya ta ba ya yanda la 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 ba ya ka ba ra ba ba ya yanda ma sha da la ba ba le ma de le 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 ya e ya de le 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 ya e ya de le 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 ya ra ba ba la ba la ba ya ta ba la ba la ba ya yanda la ba ba ra ba ba ya yanda la ba la ba ya ta ba ya yanda ra ba ba la ba ba ya e ma ra ba ba ya yanda la ba la ba ya o ma de le 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 ya ha ya de le 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 ya ha ya de le 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 ya ta ba ya ba ya yanda ra ba ba la ba ba ra ba ba la ba ra ba ba la ba ba ra ba ba la ba ra ba ra ba ba ha ya yanda la ba ya yanda ra ba ya ba ya ra ba ba la ba ra ba ba ya e ma de le 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 ya ha ma da la 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 ba ya yanda ra ba ya ra ba ba la ba ra ba ra ba ya ka ba ya ra ba ba ya yanda la ba yanda ba ya ha ya yanda la ba ya ba ya yanda la ba ya ba ra ba 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 ya yanda la ba ya le ka ba ya yanda la ba ba ya yanda la ba ya ka da la ba la ba la ba ya ya yanda la 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 ba ya yanda la ba la ba ya ya ma ya yanda la 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 ba ya ka ba ya yanda ba ya yanda la ba ya e me da me da me da me da me da me da ba ya yanda la 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 ba ya yanda ma ya ka ba la ba la ba ya ra ba ba la ba la ba ya yanda la ba e ya ma da la 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 ba ya ka ba ya yanda ra ba ba la ba la ba ya yanda anda la 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 ba ya yanda la ba la ba ya le pe le 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 Ra ba ba la ba la ba ba ya ka ba, amanda la ba ba ya amanda la ba ba ya, ba ba la ba la ba ba ya amanda la ba ya, ha ya amanda la 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 ba ya amanda la ba ya, amanda la ba ba la ba ba la ba ya amanda la ba ba, ra ba ba la ba la ba ba la ba ya amanda la ba ya, ha ba la ba la ba ba ya amanda la ba la ba ya, ha ya amanda la ba ba ya amanda la ba ya, le 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 le
Divine connection into divine collection in the name of Jesus. The Lord is willing to bring some few people that are in this place. Um, the first person I want to pray for is someone who is called Mavis. Yep. Mavis. Now, the Lord is speaking to me directly that I should pray for you about the issues of marital life. I've seen this and and the Lord should pray for you that the enemy will want to attack your marital life, your marital life, to be specific, your marital life. That what is going to what's going to do is that like even if you get you get money, it is not going to be long. There is going to be a, a package somewhere, and, and and then you get to marry to another person, and that thing will also break. It is something that it is it is it is something that is is in the family that is rooted in the family that we must deal with and break that thing once and for all. Now, I want to also pray for someone who is called Mavis. I don't know. Mavis. Yes, please. I'm Mavis on this platform. Yes, please. I'm on. It's Mavis on this platform. Yeah. I'm, I'm praying for you because the Lord, the Lord, the Lord is speaking to me that we also want to make a step, a step. We want to take a step. But the step that you want to take, it, 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 it's as if you are confused in which, in which way to take, what to do at that particular point in time. And the Lord said, I should also pray for you to take the right step at the right time so that whatever that he has assigned for you will come to pass in your life. Amen. So one is your man to you and run, one is that, that step you want to take. That the Lord said, I should tell you that he's with you and he, he has not forsaken you. He's going to help you in everything that you're doing. So don't be downhearted. That is what I said from the Lord. He said, I should tell you not to be downhearted and never give up because he's going to order yourself to where you belong. And he's going to make sure that the thing upon, that is upon your heart will be activated right now. I want to also pray for someone. He, the person is called Jackie. Exactly. I want to pray for that person. Now it is like you take a step, you are going forward, and something pushes you back. Anytime you take a step, you want to move forward, something pushes you back. It is it is as if that they don't want you to get into the next step in life. But the Lord said, I should tell you that that altar that speaks against greatness in your house, in your family, has been dealt with. Tonight, in the name of Jesus, it has been dealt in tonight in the name of Jesus. Yeah. Let me pray for maybe now. I pray for you wherever that you are in the name of Jesus. Any marital issues, any problem, challenges, I catch you now by the power of the Holy Ghost. Any evidence that the enemy wants to use against your marital life today by the power of the Holy Ghost, I reverse it in the name of Jesus. I also for Jackie and I declare that from henceforth, no one will pull you back. You will rise up and you shall be promoted 
your promotion will come. 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 In the name of Jesus. Amen. That's called Paulina. 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 That the Lord said, I should pray with you. It is as if you are you are you are you are down heart. It's as if you are down. Things you wanted it to go on is not going on the way you want it to go. Sometimes, sometimes you become down. You are so down hearted. Sometimes you ask yourself, am, am I really the Paulina that I, I see? Is, is anything wrong with me? Is something going on? My life it is happening to me. The Lord said, I can tell you that He is with you. The Lord said, He is with you. He shouldn't be down. He is with you. He is with you. He said, I will never forsake thee nor abandon thee. The Lord said, I should tell you He is with you. Now, you want to make a major, a, a big decision in your life. And the Lord said, I should tell you to go before Him. Within the next few days, he's going to speak to you and direct you what to do. He's going to speak to you and direct you what to do in these three days. He's going to reveal himself to you. He's going to give you a specific instruction. He's going to give you a specific instruction for that step before you take that step. Within the next three days, go before God in prayer. He's going to direct you and he's going to help you Take that major decision, and that thing is going to bless your life forever. God said, I should tell you, it's going to bless the fruit of your womb and bless your descendants as well. In the name of Jesus. Mm-hmm. Vanessa, mm-hmm. I want to pray for Vanessa. There is, there is someone here called Vanessa. I see yes. promotion coming your way. I see promotion coming your way. I see Amen. promotion coming your way. I hear God saying, Tell Vanessa. That Promotion is coming. Promotion is coming. Don't know what you are doing. Don't know where you work or what. Lord said, I should tell Vanessa that promotion is coming. Promotion is coming. Get ready. I don't know whether you do it or not. I see a marital blessing about to rest upon you. I see a curse being broken. I see a curse being broken, and I see God. Marital blessing upon you. Amen. I don't know if there's anyone on this platform called David. I don't know if there's anyone on this platform called David. I don't know if there's anyone on this platform called David. Is David here? Is David there. I pray for you. David, the Lord said, I should pray for you. The Lord said, I should pray for you. David, the Lord said, I should pray for you. I don't know where you are, David, but the Lord said I should pray for you. The Lord said I should pray with you. That there is there is coming a storm. Please listen to me, David. There is coming a storm. Now, that storm is not coming to end your life, but that storm is going to remove all the bad friends around your life. The Lord said. He's taking you to a next level. Be careful about friends, people that are around you. Please, are you are you following me? Are you there? The Lord said, He's taking you to the next level, but be very careful about friends. Friends around you. Because there are some friends that must be removed from your life for you to have your faith. Sometimes God causes people to neglect and neglect that so that God will separate us from them. The Lord said, I should tell you, he's going to remove some friends from your life. When you see them going, don't be disappointed. They must go for you to see the glory of God in your life. They must go to see the glory of God in your life. I pray for you in the name of Jesus that you will not die before your time. But the grace of God in Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. And I pray for for Otu. I cancel every debt appointment. 
every spirit of the ground life. Any dream that you see dead people, do not I terminate it in Jesus' name. The Bible says, you will not die and live to declare the words of the Lord. That punishment of death. Life. 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 May the Lord be with you. May His grace be sufficient. I want you to open your mouth wherever that you are. You are praying this last prayer with me before I pray with you for my leave. You are saying, my God, you see the you see the in our lives. They will see your hand in your lives. You ask the good to do extra. The to do Open your
That is disturbing you of late. You feel that pain in your right leg. Your hand The power of the Lord is here to reveal it to you. The Bible said this is why He came to die for us, that those that are in their infirmities and iniquities shall be taken off. He said by His stripes we are healed. In the name of Jesus, I declare my every pain in that I repeat it in Jesus. I rebuke in Jesus' name. I rebuke in Jesus' name. I declare that you are healed right now. In the name of Jesus. I declare that you are healed right now. In the mighty name of Jesus. I declare that you are healed right now. In the name of Jesus. I rebuke that, that pain. I rebuke that pain. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. Be healed. In the mighty if you are sick in any part of your body, I want you to put your hand there. Just put your hand there right now. Let me pray with you. Sick in any part of your body, please just put your hand there. Sick in any part of your body, just put your hand there. Any part of you. Can you close your eyes? Let's pray. Father, we send forth your word. The Bible said, For you sent forth your word to take our disease. In the name of Jesus, every pain from the crown of your head to the soul of your head, I rebuke that pain in the name of Jesus. I rebuke that pain in the name of Jesus. I the Lord is. There is someone on this platform who, who is having this severe heart problem. You have this pain in the heart. That pain has been there for three months. You feel that pain in your heart. You feel it. And you think that it is something that is about to happen to you. I catch that pain from your heart. It cannot stay in your body. There is someone you have you are you are you are you are feeling this bad thing. You are feeling this bad thing. You cannot sit down straight. Anytime you sit down, adjust yourself. I see the power of God touching you. I destroy it right now in the name of Jesus. Amen. I come against it in the name of Jesus. Amen. So ever, I rebuild that pain from your life. I declare I declare you free by the power of God. Jesus, I cast the sins now in the mighty name of Jesus. Be free. Amen. Be free in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus, we call it that. Hallelujah. 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 Amen. Right. Um, um, I don't know if there's anyone there who has a testimony about the Lord touching him or her and healing him right now. You can just let us know. Before I do the next thing and I leave, if you feel the power of God touch you right now, uh, let us know quickly and let us go to see that miracle. Uh, I feel the power of God all over you. You are not living here with that box. You are not living here with that burden. You are not living here in that prison. You are standing out because the blood of Jesus has taken over. The blood of Jesus has taken over. Out of Jesus has taken over. 
Lord of Jesus, I pray. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Are you are you here? Are you here? Can you hear me, please? Yes. I want to pray for Philo. I want to pray for Philo. Um, I want to pray for Philo. Um, I want to pray for Philo. Um, and also encourage you. And the Lord said, I should tell you that we can be a better person. Uh, there is this thing that, that has happened to you. And it is like anybody that is disappointed to you. And the Lord said, I pray with you. Every disappointment. And turn every disappointment into appointment. Life. You are coming out from every prison yard to the palace. Every evidence leveled against you will be Your life shall be taken off from your life. And every covenant shall be broken. I am seeing a covenant from this altar. You see, I am seeing a covenant from this altar. And I hear them saying that, uh, I hear them saying that we will stop it. We will stop it. There is a major event that is coming your way. And they want to put an end to it once and for all. And that thing is going to come as a result of an accident. I don't know how it is going to be. But I saw you in a car. And I saw that the car had had an accident as a bit of a brake failure. I don't know how, why, but it is going to be on, on a Friday morning. It was like you were going for, for a work because I saw you dressed up and I saw that the, 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 the color of your clothes was, was a blue, a blue black color, something like a suit. And it was like you were going for a work, something like an accident in the car. And the Lord said, I should pray for you. Now that accident is coming because there is going to be a great major breakthrough that is going to come your way this very Friday. And there's something that is going to happen to you. And they want to put a stop to that thing. And that thing is coming from an altar, a, an altar that is in your bloodline. And the Lord said, I should deal with that thing. Because if I don't destroy it, that is what is going to happen. They are going to bring that aspect stop to everything and they are going to paralyze you but in the name of jesus i don't know whoever wants to bring you down but my god will put a stop to it he said let them gather to let them speak their way it will not stand for god is every gathering every meeting against your life any accident will terminate Everything that has been leveled at you in the courtroom of heaven, we declare right now. Lord. Jesus, put a stop to it now. We declare mm. freedom. Receive your freedom in Jesus' name. Mm. Jesus. I want to pray for Betty. I want to pray for Betty. I want to pray for Betty. Um, I'm seeing, I'm seeing, sorry to say, I'm seeing something like. A cancer, and that cancer must be dealt with, and it is going to start with something like a pain, sorry to say, in your breast, because I'm I'm seeing that thing, that numbness, and the Lord said it is something that they want to bring towards you, something like a cancer, cancer of the breast, but the Lord said I should pray with you and cast that spirit out, any cancer, any cancer, any pain, any. They want to bring towards you in the name of Jesus. I come in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, I rebuke it now. It will never be in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. It will never come to pass because it Against your 
shall let it now in the name of Jesus. We will now break loose in Jesus' name. Now I want you to pray for the two hands to which you said. And let me pray with you. Let's put the two hands to what you said. And let me pray with you. Laba Kabara Bashada. Labra Tosha. Labra Tosha. Stretch for your two hands. Be in the mood of expectancy. Be in the mood of expectancy. Stretch for your two hands. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Father, in the name of Jesus. We thank you for your time. Towards you. Our hands are lifted towards you. I pray that Lord, you will put your hands towards your children. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. As they are created upon you. Nobody comes to you and you made a decision. Nobody comes to you and you made a decision. I pray in the name of Jesus that by this nation, Lord, you open up the heavens for your children. Let every enemy, let every enemy leveled against them. Let every distraction be destroyed. We against them. We will that the power. We bless the devil against your children. We declare that they will all the right. In the name of the name of Jesus. Let your enemies scatter. Let God arise and let your enemies scatter. Let God arise. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Amen. You will never lack. You will never Jesus' name. As Joseph was lifted to the palace in the prison, so shall it be that the Lord will lift him. Life. They cannot stop you. The Bible said the Lord was with the Israelites like a pillar of cloud by day and a pillar of fire by night. And the Bible said he took them through the Red Sea and he brought them to the promised land. May the Lord be with you like a pillar of cloud by day. How you go through, may the Lord be with you. Side, I, the Lord will honor you. Pray that the Lord will lift you. His grace will be sufficient for you. Amen. 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 Can I do this thing for my heart close. Um, you know, I said something. The altar you connect to determines the altar. You collect today is the bed of our prophet of God. We we will want to connect by our sacrifice. So anytime you connect to the altar, you collect from the altar. And anytime you put your sacrifice on the altar, you are having a covenant. With that spirit behind the altar. We want to connect as we are in the month of August, the month of eight, a month of a new beginning. Maybe you want to start something. You want to start a business. You want to start a work. You want to start something. You want to connect with your seed of eight. You can be in any currency, any, anything. You connect with the seed of eight onto the life of the man of God. You want to just commit for God to begin something new in your life. You can do that after your prayers. You can do that and God will bless you. God bless you. May his grace be sufficient for you. May his hand be lifted up for you. And I pray that every evil prophecy that has been spoken against you shall be unturned. It shall, it shall be destroyed. And the Lord will bless you according to his will, in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Amen.
Wow, 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 wow. We give God the praise. We bless the name of the Lord for such a wonderful time in the presence of the Lord. Uh, we give God the praise. I believe, you know, this is our first our first time of trying a, a, a program such like, like this. I chose, I chose my birthday to do that. And I, I thank my brother for coming on uh, all the way from West Africa, Ghana, I tell you. Uh, we give God the praise. We give God the praise. There was a little bit of um, uh, connection uh, issues and all of that, but we are praying the next, the next segment that we're going to host uh, we'll be able to uh, put a few things together, make it more clear for everyone so that you'll be able to hear. Uh, I think some some people couldn't hear uh, prophecies that you are receiving. Maybe some were a um, little bit heard and some were not. But I, I believe that at the end of the day, what God has spoken is going to manifest. That which the enemy plots and plans, we believe that tonight... We have received that grace to override. When the enemy came after the life of Daniel, he threw, he threw him into the lion's den, threatened his life, but the grace to do exploit brought him out. I remember what the king said when he went to the mouth of the lion's den, and he said, Daniel, has your God been able to save you? Has your God, in whom you trust, been able to deliver you? When your enemies ask those questions, may you have the voice to respond in the name of Jesus. May your finances have the voice to respond in the name of Jesus Christ. May the position God put you have the voice to respond to their, to, to their questions in the name of Jesus Christ. May the Lord cause that grace to do exploit to continue to manifest in explosive manner in your life today in the name of Jesus Christ. Now, I will come back uh, to pray a final prayer over you before we leave. We want to take a, a short announcement from uh, Sister Mavis uh, from, for all of us. So please pay attention to the announcement. And then after, I will come back for a prayer over everybody that is connected tonight. I'm really grateful uh, for the man of God. We're going to pray for the man of God after the announcement. So please don't leave. We're going to pray for the man of God. And we're going to ask for God's grace of uh, the man of God's life. Amen and amen. 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 Hallelujah. Praise God. Can you hear me? Yes. Okay. So uh, basically, I just want to briefly remind everybody that God willing tomorrow, um, 10 p.m. Once again, we will be gathering on our OFYM upper room prayer line for a wonderful time of prayer together as the saints of God in the presence of God. So we encourage you to please make time, join, come and pray. You can never say that you're tired of prayer. It is indeed the breath of the believer. Amen. So we will not relent. We will not stop. We will continue to pray. Amen. Likewise, on Friday at midnight, midnight um, Eastern Standard Time, we will be gathering again for our Grace Point service which is a wonderful time of word of God and prayer. So we encourage you to please set your alarms because it's a bit late. Sometimes the enemy want to try to use the time to, you know, play little games here and there. You want to be vigilant and set forth your alarms so that you be ready as a soldier of Christ to come and take on. Amen. We're going to gather together and pray once again. For those of you that have been coming on, you know what God has been doing through our Grace Points for this prayer line. It is very powerful. You do not want to miss out. You want to spread the word and also invite your friends and your family to join. And again, on Sunday, we are meeting at Bethel Auditorium. We thank the Lord God Almighty for the reopening of our church. And I believe those of you that were able to make it last week, you felt a different realm of connection. Hallelujah. There is power in the gathering, the physical gathering of the saints. Therefore, when that opportunity has been given unto us by our God, for we prayed for it, we do not want to relent. You want to be part of it. We encourage you to please register. Even as we have given out the instructions, go on our website or our church app, register and uh, reserve your seat so that we can adequately prepare to receive you on Sunday, 10 a.m. sharp. Together, we will gather and praise our God. 
And again, I know those of you know that every year we have a fantastic time of fasting and prayers in the presence of God. Amen. Um, I hope you were not thinking that pandemic was going to stop us from fasting seven days after prayer. Hallelujah. Amen. We are not going to relent this year. It is coming on live. It's going to start August 10th to the 16th. It is seven days of fasting and prayer. It is our absolute fasting. That means no food for you and I. It is okay. You're not going to die. God is going to give us the grace. And this year, the theme for our fasting, it is grace to have advantage in uncertain times. Hallelujah. It is such a time like this that we need such a grace to have an advantage in the midst of a pandemic, in the midst of all the uncertainty that is going on around the world. But as the people of God, we are positioning ourselves strategically. So you want to be part of it and watch out for the fire that will be coming out very soon for our fasting. And during the fasting time, beloved, every night we will be gathering on the prayer line at midnight. Hallelujah. At midnight, the watchers will rise and we will pray to the God of heaven and we shall see a revival. We shall see a move of God in the body of Christ. We will see the power of God in life renewal charismatic church. Amen. So we encourage everybody to start preparing your mind, your body, your heart. If you feel like you're already like, oh my God, I can't believe it. Stop praying for grace. And I believe the Lord God Almighty is going to grant you that. Amen. God bless you so much. And I pass it over to Prophet Kofi. Hallelujah. We give God the praise. I'm excited about the fast. Hey, you know, you, all, you always know me. That seven days is a glorious time. And we thank God for that. So please look forward to that. It's going to be a wonderful time in the presence of God. Every night, 12 a.m., we will be on the prayer line, live on the prayer line. It's going to be a wonderful time. So you won't get the chance to uh, connect on Facebook Live or YouTube Live or live stream. It will be on a... Um, prayer line so if you are outside of 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 montreal or canada you can call the toll free number it is free it's toll free number uh the numbers will be there so just check it on our uh, church website and even on our various platforms and please connect and those of you that are in montreal uh there will be a local number for you to call through that so that you wouldn't need to call the toll free number you will just call the local number that will be given to those of you that are in Montreal. So it'll be easy for you to just call in uh, if you are in Montreal. But those that are outside, you can call the toll-free uh, number. Even if you are in Ghana, uh, South Africa, we have people around the world who call in. So um, it will be free for you to call in. And we can't wait. Uh, I believe and I'm praying that I will be able to have Prophet Charles with us once again uh, during the time of the fasting and prayer. I, I'm hoping that I'll be able to get him. Amen. So I give God the praise uh, for his life. We give God the glory for his life. Uh, the last time I was in Ghana, uh, I didn't I didn't get to uh, see him. Uh, the last time that uh, we saw each other, I believe, was 2017 when I was in Ghana. I ministered in his church. It was a glorious time in the presence of the Lord. Uh, he's, he's a man that travels a lot. Oh, my goodness. He travels a lot. He can be talking to you one minute and then five minutes time, he's, he call him and then he's, he's in somewhere else. You know, so <laughs> he carries the Philip anointing. I always say that. I give God the praise for his life. So we're going to pray for him. Uh, uh, it is not easy ministering, you know, in the virtual world, but uh, we want to pray for God's grace over him. And we want to, we want to ask for uh, the, 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 the longevity oil to continue to burn over his life. And we are praying for the church that he leads, that the glory of God will always lead, that the Lord will make him prevail over those who seek to bring him down, that he will run before the pursuer, that his strength to run before the pursuer will never dim and will never go down. In the name of Jesus. Church, I want you to lift up your voice. Wherever you are tuning in, whether you are watching us on Empowerment TV, wherever you are co connecting, lift up prayer. Let's begin to pray for the man of God in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, we give you glory. We, we give you all the praise for what you have done this very hour, oh God. We thank you, oh God, for the life of the man of God. We thank you, oh God, for what you have done in his life. We thank 
thank you, O oh God, for the grace that you have poured through him unto us. We pray, O oh God, any virtue that has come out, we pray for restoration in the name of Jesus Christ. I pray for restoration, O oh God, in the name of Jesus. I pray for restoration of strength in the name of Jesus. Every virtue that has come out, I pray for restoration, O oh God, in the mighty name of Jesus. Strengthen him, O oh God. Cover his family, O oh God. Protect his children, O oh God. Preserve his family, O oh God. In the name of Jesus Christ. From any arrow, any backfiring arrows, any satanic, demonic comebacks that will target his life, his family, his ministry. Let the awakes backfire in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I ask, oh God, that you will hide the family, you will hide this ministry, you will hide this life in the pavilions of Elohim in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. That them that will point their finger in accusation, let their hands wither in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. My father, my warrior, sit him in the seat of glory, sit him in the seat of favor, sit him in the seat of empowerment, sit him in the seat of strength in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Sit him in the seat of longevity in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. That his finishing will be great than even his beginning in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. That his end will be greater than his beginning in the name of Jesus Christ. I thank you, O oh God, for what you have done. Oh, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. My father, my warrior, I give you praise and glory. I thank you for tonight's meeting. I bless you for what you have done. I give you all the praise for the set man of God that you used, oh God, as a vessel to bless your people tonight. I pray, oh God, that every word of a blessing prophecy that came out, I pray may it be established. Let every agenda of darkness that was revealed, let it be scattered and never have a grounds to stand on in the name of Jesus Christ. I pray, oh God, that from tonight, from today, this prophetic day of August 5th, I decree and I declare that let every word that you have spoken over your people that bring elevation, let it be established and let it manifest. 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 Let the word that came out of your mouth, oh God, concerning the elevation of your people, let that word never miss a target. In the name of Jesus Christ, let it find the receiver. In the name of Jesus Christ, I pray by the power of the Holy Ghost and by the ordinance of heaven, I decree over your life. In the name of Jesus, on the best day of my life, I prophesy over you that you shall do exploit. You shall expand from grace to grace, from favor to favor. In the name of Jesus Christ, the hands that seek to destroy, let that hand with that over your life. In the name of Jesus Christ, the eyes that monitor you, let that eye be blindfolded. In the name of Jesus Christ, ah, the ear that anticipate the bad news about you, in the name of Jesus, let that ear never grow dumb. Let that ear never grow deaf, but let it continue opening to the realm of the good news over your life. In the name of Jesus Christ, even when they don't want to hear, they shall hear the good news of God over your life. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I prophesy over your life. Divine preservation. In the name of Jesus, that grace, that oil that has preserved me to this time, I command that oil over you. In the name of Jesus Christ, that when men seek to put you in the grave, you shall not go in the grave. You shall stay alive. You shall fulfill the mandate of God concerning your life. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, and I pray on he who died and rose again on the third Day. May he keep you from falling. May he watch over you. May he watch over your family. May he watch over your children. May he watch over your endeavors in the name of Jesus Christ. Blessed shall you be in the city. Blessed shall you be in the country. Blessed shall you be when you go out. Blessed shall you be when you come in. Blessed shall be your basket and your needing bowl in the name of Jesus 
Christ, for that which you touch by day shall be blessed, and that which you touch by night shall increase in the name of Jesus. Harvest shall never cease in your house. Harvest and increase shall never cease in your house. I prophesy with, as a prophet of the living God over you in the name of Jesus Christ that you will run the race to victory in the name of Jesus Christ. Your end shall be greater than your beginning in the name of Jesus. I prophesy over you in the name of Jesus that let your enemies live long. I decree, Lord, let our enemies live long. Let them not see death. Let not their flesh see corruption, but let them live long to see the testimony that you're about to manifest in our lives. In the name of Jesus Christ, I pray over you. May your head never lack oil. May your head never lack oil. May your head never lack favor. May your head never lack the countenance of God. Let it continue to shine over you. In the name of Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God. I prophesy in the midst of this pandemic, you shall be advantaged in the name of Jesus Christ. You shall walk in an advantageous era, in an advantageous realm. When men cry, you shall be testifying to the glory of God. In the name of Jesus. When men are limited, you shall not be limited. In the name of Jesus Christ. I pray in this very day, that angel that has that has walked with me throughout the time of my calling until now, I command that that faithfulness and that work of that angel, let it be that same level of zeal over the guardian angel that watches over you in the name of Jesus Christ. May the work of God in your life never cease. In the name of Jesus. May the heavens never close. May you never be disadvantaged under closed heavens, but may you be advantaged over open heavens. In the name of Jesus Christ. I prophesy over you, this month of August, this month of August, May you experience fruitfulness in higher levels, in higher dimensions, in higher great great points of your life. In the name of Jesus, may you experience abundance of rain, abundance of rain, abundance of rain, abundance of rain. rain. As the prophet of God said, may you be divinely connected to collect in the name of Jesus Christ. May you be divinely connected to collect every favor, every good thing, every mandate, every help, any help you need, may you divinely collect in the name of Jesus. Not even a word will miss you in the name of Jesus Christ, the son of the living God. May that oil overflow. May that oil overflow in this month of August. In this month of August, unprecedented miracles find you in the name of Jesus Christ. Unprecedented great doors be opened before you in the name of Jesus Christ. May you never be hindered and may you never be blocked. May you never be stopped. Anyone that will be on the highway, low way, small way to block you, may they be arrested by the hand of the Lord. I command, let the way be paved unto you in the name of Jesus Christ. And may you walk in that grace exploit in the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' name, amen and amen. If you can text amen, text amen. If you want to shout amen, shout amen. We give God the praise. We give God the glory. God richly bless you. God richly bless you. So we'll connect tomorrow night. God bless everyone that wish me happy birthday. This is my birthday gift to you. I thank God uh, uh, that this gift will be a sign of greater things to come in your life, starting from now, even in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. God bless you all. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you.